Hey everybody, it's Brett and today I'm going to show you how to get into your engineering test mode on your Ford Mustang, the S197 5th generation Mustang. And basically it's going to be good for the instrument cluster that I have in this car. I have a 2013 Shelby GT500 here and I'm going to show you how to get into that engineering test mode and then we'll go over why that's kind of cool uh, to get into that and everything that's in there. So I'm going to get the camera all set up and I'll show you right now. Okay, it's pretty simple to get it into engineering test mode. All you gotta do is hold the OK button in and then turn the ignition on. You don't wanna start the car, but you wanna turn the ignition on. And then as soon as you see it say engineering test mode up there, you're gonna to wanna to let go of that OK button. If you hold on to it too long, it'll just go back into normal mode. So I'm gonna press the OK button. I recommend that you take the key out, open the door, reset everything, and then uh, you can do this. So hit the OK button. I'm gonna get my camera set up here. Now I'm gonna turn the ignition on. It's gonna go into engineering test mode. You can let go of that OK button. Now you have your gauge test. And what's kinda of cool about this is that now you can go into all the different settings. And it gives you a color test on the instrument cluster. If you press, I'm pressing OK again to get through all these, all micro, micro continuous bulbs on. So this is everything. I'm just gonna go through everything. And you can probably go on the internet and figure out what all these codes mean. But the big one is this. This gives you a digital speedometer. Now if I start the car, this screen will stay up and you can actually see your digital speedometer as you're driving. So that's why a lot of people like getting into this mode is for that vehicle speed. And then you got kilometers per hour too. Um, so. That's everything that's through it. And then eventually you'll get back to the original modes here. You can see there's quite a few different things. There we're back to the color test. So that would be what, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty to get to the vehicle speed, approximately. So just a lot of cool things that you can do in here and uh, yeah if you like the video let me know give me a like subscribe and share I'm gonna be doing a bunch of cool stuff with my GT500 here so that's where it starts so back to one two three four five six seven eight nine ten twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen so 19 gets you to vehicle speed. Anyways, thanks for checking out the video. Give me a like, subscribe, and share. And we're going to do some more fun stuff with the GT500 um, continuously. Thanks again.